all these battery balanced chargers that are from China and wherever else, Shenzhen or wherever they're coming from. I just wanted to let you know that I have two of these and each one of them were pieces of shit. Let's talk about the first one. Now this one seems to be a little bit better than the one that's kind of right behind it, which you would see right here. So right now, this is the Tenergy uh, battery, six, six cell battery balance charger, and it is currently discharging or trying to discharge <clears throat> that pack that you see right here. So uh, these are um, obviously LiPo 18650 cells. I just finished soldering them together. The soldering job is horrible, but that's because I wasn't able to remove the tabs properly and it's all nasty and ugh. Anyways, so these are, I'm hoping roughly about the same milliamp hour rating, but they're gonna vary by a little bit just because they're from different, uh, they're, they're from different machines and everything like that. Anyways, that's connected. I should have probably about 1800 milliamp hours in each cell, I'm hoping. So 18, I have 12. 2100 milliamp hours, hopefully. Sorry, 21,000 milliamp hours, hopefully. So basically at one, as it's discharging, as it says, at one amp, at one amp, I should be able to get 21 hours out of this, if that is correct. So the first thing I wanna mention about this, see how it says here it's on NICAD? And it's discharging at one amp and that's the current voltage whatever that's bullshit that never fucking makes any sense because if i put it in lipo if i put it in lipo setting and i discharge it it basically when i just did it i just finished doing it it, it finished and it said it had third 331 milliamp hours so that's a that's just total and utter, utter bullshit and i don't know what's up with these chargers i mean i know they're cheap and everything but you know, um, some of the stuff from China is all right because it's basically the same circuitry. So I don't know what's going on here. Obviously it's reading this incorrectly. And just to let you guys know, I have calibrated this thing by holding these two buttons when you power up and putting a current into it that's accurate. I also measured it with my multimeter and uh, that's that should be calibrated. So anyways, I don't know what's up with this reading. It's kind of crazy. I don't think the batteries are reading three volts at this time. This thing's got problems. Uh, so that's that charger there. Now the IMAX B6, again, this is another uh, knockoff that I bought from, was it from eBay? I think it was from eBay. Cause I thought I'd have better luck with this guy than the Tenergy, but this has its own other issues, which is, Roughly the same thing. It, it 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 just doesn't report the voltages properly, and maybe I can understand that or whatever. But my 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 problem is is how are you supposed to get an accurate reading from this? So uh, in this one here, I can't actually calibrate the voltage. I, that's disabled. One thing I was able to do, which I don't know if I screwed it up even more, was I was able to hold these two buttons here, and powering it up and holding these two buttons and basically it shows you each of the six cells and what the voltage is at. Now I didn't have anything connected at that time, so they all showed zero, but I was able to get back into that. Um, I was able to get back into that menu and I don't know. So I'm basically what I'm doing with this is I'm waiting till all my six packs are, are completed, my six cells, and then I'm gonna hook it up and see if I can calibrate it. But anyways, they might still be good for some things, but you know, right now, let's go back to the other guy. Now, what I'm doing is I'm I'm discharging a NICAD at one amp and I'm hoping that uh, when it reaches 0.1 of a volt, which is the setting in NICAD mode, that these batteries will roughly be around three volts or just under that. So we're gonna see, I'm gonna let this run overnight and I'll probably update you guys later. All right, thanks for watching, see you.